Celine, and I am stupid. All right. Okay, today I'm just going to go over some of the mods that um, I've done for, let's say, Poppy, uh, Baby in Yellow, Arbs. I went back and did some Arbs mods just for the just to remember how to do them, and Band Band Six. Uh, some updates on the mod menu. Anyway, yes, this was done for Charles Box. It's obviously a dog day. I did a cat nap as well as mommy long legs. Um, I do not sell these. I just make them for my videos, which don't do very well, or I make them for requests by people, and that was a commission. Um, I could probably sell the dog day, but I don't have any really reason to do so. And so, yeah, I might want to do a full playthrough on another channel and see if it does any better. Otherwise, it was pretty much a dead mod. Did okay for Charles. Um, I think he got 40000 plus for just the grinder scene, so that was what it was for. Anyway, it's it's full mod. He only does the grinder scenes, really, and I went ahead and put her, put Dog Day in as Mommy and tried to get the lips to move as much as I could. It's a little hard when the lips aren't starting off as clothes and I didn't want to mess with the model so all right moving on to arbs so as you can see I tried this on my one channel that did well with baby in yellow um, I did a newt and a baby head but I didn't do the torso or anything so I think I should do the torso if I'm going to continue with this mod which so far I don't see any reason to because there was little to zero interest on um, the video that I did for it. Now, I don't know if that was just timing, bad thumbnails, which I can't get any better at doing. I spend time making thumbnails and they just aren't going to be any good. Um, so, yes, I'm not going to pay somebody to make thumbnails for me when I literally don't make any money on videos. It's just a lose-lose situation. So, I'm not making pretty thumbnails. I know that everybody says, oh, your videos are fine. No, they're not. They're not going to get any traction whether they have a good thumbnail or not. I've seen where I had great thumbnails and they still didn't do well. So... Um, it's all about if your channel is growing and Full Tilt On is not. So, Full Tilt On is pretty much a done... I mean, I can keep trying. I was thinking about doing some face cams and some gameplays. Um, I'm not even crazy about some of the games I mod. Ban Ban is one that I feel like I have to mod. Um, mainly, I do it. Big Puru actually has some sex successes with it. And <clears throat> I will continue to do that for him. And that is why I do these. So I will show you those later. I've done some uh, Lethal Company. I just did that one in Gob 6. And I have a bunch of other things that I'm porting over to Gob that I had from before. But anyway, um, I had a lot of that. Oh, here you go. Okay, some... for our final race, we will have Pomni and Kinger, the winners of the first two races, versus Neutrina and Newt, our crowd favorites. And... They're off! Okay, and as you can see, um, we put a racetrack in. I had my son make a quick racetrack to put into there and try to keep them uh, into an oval. Uh, we thought about doing some other tracks and stuff. Uh, this video is doing okay. Um, I don't know when I will ever get back to saving Newt with Neutrina, which was my whole goal a long time back in Christmas time, or before Christmas. Um, when the update had come out and I had started that process and we never really finished the animation but it was doing well and then of course holidays came and I didn't do very much on Baby in Yellow. But anyway, uh, the mod menu is free. I, a lot of people don't really realize that. Um, there is a free mod menu out there that I made. Okay, so some updates on the Garden of Bam Bam 6 plus uh, mod menu. I've been sick for a while so bear with my nasally voice. Um, so you have a hide here so you can hide most everything as you may recall when you had to move things you had to hit retarget hope that you got it um, it would tell you static mesh component and then if you were moving it around you had to use these sliders which are not my favorite things um, that's the default slider and it does a weird I don't know what you want to call how it gets slower in the center and faster outside but so one of the other options is without the menu up is you can literally use your left thumb button right now and grab something. Um, it's more like Gmod where you can use your scroll wheel and bring it forward. If you click, okay, well, so it's not perfect yet. And um, one problem is, yeah, okay, careful. You click on double click. 
I'm not sure if I like the thumb button because my fingers are very uh, glitchy and I double click on the thumb button like that and I wasn't really so it unfortunately it doesn't recenter all the time it goes by the anchor point of the object and I was trying to redo that but it gets wonky but if you press the scroll wheel and hold then you can rotate as you would like and of course if you are just walking around you can move it around so it's almost like you paged up it and attached it to your camera but it's not really on camera it's actually on you um, and so that's selected and if I were to rotate it the regular way it would still rotate as you could see and you could technically save it and all that good stuff um, but unhide the menu and there's where all the long things are but they get out of your way so if you had for instance slow Celine um, wait a minute I did I will show some of the ones that I was doing for Big Peru I don't put these things out for everybody um, I never hardly ever sell any of them so we have donkey and Shrek and a whole bunch of other ones um, let me see recent ones we were doing were lethal company I think I have these in here let me see um, sometimes I lose track because I put the thumb there okay so we have lethal company friends we have the forest giant from Le lethal company we have I had to do ghost girl but it's funny I, I couldn't find a good 3d model so here we have ghost girl oh exe ghost girl exe watch out for ghost girl exe I just like how she walks I thought that was kind of funny anyway Shrek and ghost girl that ought to make a good video so and there's a couple other ones let's see we got the dog actually that one came out pretty good let me see we got bug and Isla's dog Isla's dog I like because it is actually a four-legged walking creature and if you do the waypoint which is here let me hide all this here if I do a waypoint then he will go between waypoints so if I pick a waypoint there and go over here for instance it's wherever the player is is the waypoints work so he didn't come to me because he's on waypoint so if I click waypoint I do not like how that's working okay he's gonna come here <clears throat> and then once he gets to that waypoint he's gonna turn around and go back to his last point if you want to put a different another waypoint in you can do that so he comes over here next and then if everybody's not in his way he'll go back to his so now he's going in a triangle basically he could go back and forth back and forth um, if you want to remove all of his waypoints and have him come back to you you can hit clear and now he's going to after he does his thing here hopefully if it still works come back to me yes and he will sit here and say I want to eat you um, uh, you undoes the last character and numpad 1 and numpad 2 you can go backwards through characters so if you hit numpad 1 it got rid of whoever that last one was which I think was ghost girl um, let's bring this back up to here and let's do the bug which I don't like the lighting of it because it doesn't show how green it is or anything here let me see it's not too bad but so here's the bug and he didn't have really any arms or anything so I just made him walk like he was flying a little bit I don't know and we negative we can ragdoll him yay so this is all what big Puru will be using in some of his future videos um, I just figured I'd show some of those and what did we have? We had Celine. We had, oh, we, yeah, I added some of these to the default menu. You have Banbelina as a friend, Ban Ban as a friend, the tiny GV, a hellish opilia. We had Dora and Boots. Uh, oops, uh, make sure that physics is not on when you spawn them. Uh, undo her. Okay. Um, summon her. And this is. Why is she T posing? Oh, I must not have the whole pack in there for some reason yeah she relies on somebody else's animation same thing with boots um hello boots where are you boots uh oh that's it there's a lot of people in here boots was funny because when i ragdolled him his head fell off so i thought that was kind of funny anyway i'm gonna pretty much wrap this up about the i'm trying to think of any i did uh obviously the skeld and the crewmates oh toothless i did toothless for him and I keep wanting to put physics on there because I keep doing that. So he uh, sort of had some dances, not really. Um, let me see. If I went to dance, what were the dances? It's this animation, but you got to pick one of these. 
wait a minute, wait a minute. All right. Well, he didn't really have the real toothless dance. Um, I didn't find that. I'm getting crowded over here. Let me go over here. You guys are all crowding me. So, yeah, that was toothless. Summon him again. Let me see if he animates this time. Sort of, kind of, yeah. Hey, look at me! But he didn't really dance because he's not even rigged. So he's just static. But I could have rigged him and put some, you know, good old Mixamo dances on there. But I didn't. Um, blah, 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 blah. This was New Celine. Okay, yeah, that's New Celine. So, and for these, if you wanted, you could hide these and you can make her head big. You can make her mouth go, Hello, my name is Slow Celine. And I want to do the toothless dance. So I'm not sure that's how she would sock because she actually talks like, Hello, I'm Slow Celine. And I am stupid. All right. So, yes, you can puppet them. You can do eyes and both. What? All right. So that was that one. Fun, fun, fun. All right. I hope that recorded.